Hi, I'm Adam. Welcome to my lab here in Peel College London. Let's do some science. This week on Late Night Science, cocaine. The newspapers frequently report that our banknotes are laced with Colombia's finest. So are you really carrying around an illegal narcotic in your wallet? We're going to find out. All I need is some cash. Mate, have you got a 20? Cheers. You can't smell it. You can't taste it. So how will we find out? Well, we can use a mass spectrometer. Follow me and I'll show you how it's done. We can't put the note directly into the spectrometer, so we need to extract all the organic material off the note. The first step in doing this is washing it with acetone. Sorry, Queenie. It's time to get wet. This is a separatory funnel. It's important to shake it quite vigorously just to get all the acetone into the note so that all the organic material dissolves. There was a metal strip here before, it's gone now. Also looks like some of the ink has faded. Sorry mate, I think I've destroyed your note. Next, I want to remove the acetone so I can see how much material we've got from the note. I'm using a rotary evaporator to rapidly remove the solvent. Because this machine uses a vacuum, I only need to heat the sample to 40 degrees Celsius before it begins to boil. As you can see, all the acetone is gone. What you're looking at there is a mixture of sweat, body oils, probably urine, and hopefully some of that sweet Florida snow. Let's put our sample back into solution and find out what's in it. So this is the mass spec machine. We're gonna put our vial in. In about 20 minutes, we'll know if we found any of the devil's dandruff. what we got. I can't show you inside the machine, so at this point you'll have to take my word for it. First, our sample is vaporised and the individual molecules get ionised by an electron beam. The mass spectrometer then accelerates them towards its detector, on their way passing a big electromagnet. As the molecules are all charged, the magnet pulls them off their course. The small, lighter molecules are deflected more than the big, heavier molecules which just steamroll past. Now the molecules have all been separated by size, the detector can measure their individual mass. The stimulant of choice for the upper middle classes, cocaine, also known as Bazooka, Bernie, The Big C, Blow, Charlie, Coco Chanel, Florida Snow, King, Mama Coca, Livian Marching Powder, Monster, Nose Candy, Stardust, White Lady, Yayu, and Inca Massage is an alkaloid ester extracted from the leaf of the coca plant. It has 17 carbon atoms, 21 of hydrogen, a single nitrogen, and 4 oxygen atoms. We can work out its mass directly from the periodic table. Carbon has an atomic mass of 12.011 daltons, nitrogen 14.007, oxygen 15.999 and hydrogen 1.0079 all adding up to a total of around 304 and that's the number we have to look out for. So the results are in. I can see here we have a massive peak at 304, the magic number, which means that this note has tested positive for cocaine. So mate, do you want it back? Really? Fair enough. See you later.